The necrobiome is the community of organisms associated with a decaying corpse as described in 2013 by Benbow et al. The term is often confused to be focused on only on the microbial component of the entire community of species that interact with a carcass, such as the insects and vertebrate scavengers. The process of decomposition is complex, and aside from microorganisms such as bacteria, other organisms help to decompose the cadaver including fungi, nematodes, and insects as well as larger scavenger animals. The process of decomposition is fundamental to the cycle of life. As death ensues, the microbial ecosystem that lived off the living organism collapses and, nourished by the decomposition, a new and changing microbial ecosystem establishes itself. It has been noted that there is first a shift from aerobic to anaerobic bacteria, leading to putrefaction and bloating. A shift back to aerobic bacteria occurs in the abdominal cavity when it gets opened. Bacteria come from the body as well as the environment. It has been difficult to study the necrobiome as the vast majority of its bacteria do not grow well in the laboratory environment. Our understanding of naturally occurring necrobiomes is further complicated by the fact that different portions of a corpse may be in different stages of decomposition. However, the ability to apply advanced sequencing has helped researchers to investigate and monitor the necrobiome. The composition of the necrobiome appears to change in a predictable way representing a microbial clock apparently regardless of season, species, or soil type. The speed of the decomposition is, however, temperature dependent. It has been suggested that the predictability of the sequence of changes of the necrobiome may be useful in forensics to help determine the time of death. See also Microbiology of decomposition Biome Human microbiome